Hi gang, Alyssa Marty here from Misadventures with the Martys. Um, me and Trevor made it to our destination thanks to my sister. Thank you so much Sissy for dropping us off in Pipestone. Um, they have a lot of falling trees at this campground. So you might hear a chainsaw in the background. They, I think they had a big tree that fell quite a ways up. Um, we're supposed to be at campsite A, um, but there was too many trees that fell. We are at campsite E for me, yeah. Alyssa. Alyssa. Cool. Yeah. Um, we got here. The temperature is really nice and reasonable compared to yesterday. It's cool. I'm a little overcast um, on the way here. Oh my God, you guys. It poured. There was times where my sister couldn't see the road. I mean, it was coming down in buckets. And then towards our destination, it was raining off and on. But here in Pipestone, it's not raining at all. It's gorgeous today. Um, we got our fresh water. We have set up camp. Uh, Trev put the bicycles together so the bikes are ready. Um, tomorrow we start our our big adventure and I'm not gonna lie gang I'm a little nervous I'm excited um, this is huge I mean we're bicycling across the state and um, I'm very honored I get to do it with my husband okay so let's go into our here's our tent here's our bicycles and the tent it's a Kelty Grand Mesa 2 I got it at a discount. I'm a discount shopper. And, um, here it is. There we go. Pretty fun, huh? Both of those are guilty too because they were on sale. We're not being sponsored, but if they want to sponsor us, we'll take it. As long as they don't do stupid stuff. And this is our little spot. And there was a big storm, so there's a tree came down. Right now, we're in Pipestone National Monument. And uh, going across, big field of native grasses. I see uh, all kinds. There's a, there's a deer way off in the distance you're not going to see. If the wind is bad, sorry. There's Aunt Alyssa, monster right there. Go back the other way. Um, there's some purple stuff. I don't know the name of the purple stuff. And there's some great tall grass, we call it deep grass. I don't know what its other name is. And there's some um, of those yellow Susan flowers. A lot of milkweed. Lots of birdies. Huh. Look at that old bur oak right there. I love them trees. Good morning, everybody. This is Trevor, reporting from the first morning of our bike packing tour through Minnesota. And these Thermarest mats we bought are garbage. And I am feeling all of my almost 50 years. Oofta. How about you, Alyssa? Oh, good morning, everybody. The Thermarest things, they fucking suck. Um, Unless you want to buy them from us, in which case they're great. Yeah, they're great if you want something. <laughs> We're on our big adventure. Our big ride across the state of Minnesota. That's what we're doing. We're riding across the state of Minnesota just so we can so we can see, see what it's like here. And, and well, because we live here anyway, but you know, the other parts that we don't have to actually get to. So um, yeah, let me turn you around. You can see we're in Pipestone. We're starting in Pipestone and going all the way to uh, 
to uh, Red Wing, Minnesota. So I'll turn you around then and you can see from here you can see there's a lot of flowers. I don't know if you can see those flowers with this little camera. Motorcycles. Over here's Alyssa. And see this place they have this thing here for you to fix your bike if you need to. Uh, this is a Minnesota State Trail. So you can put your horses on here but you have to have a permit. You can put um, motor, I mean snowmobiles, but you have to have a permit. Corridor 8, whatever that is. What do you think, Alyssa? Um, the weather is really nice. It's a little warm, but not bad. Um, I am so excited for this big journey. Yeah, let's uh, get a load of her bike. This is her bike with all the stuff here. This is the other camera. And uh, yeah. I have my two water bottles, plus I have my water bladder. There's one under there. Probably don't need it, but we, you know, whatever. You, well, never, you know. never know. You know, never know how hot it's going to get. It's yep. July, folks. Ooh, we got to not let um, this happen. This will get ooh. caught. Put it under here. So I have the. In this bag, I have my sleeping bag, my mat, and um, the toiletries in here. The other one on the other side has and the electronics. Yeah. So, yeah. And here's my bag. She's got new panniers. I don't. Mine are old. But I think they'll do the job. This is my little diamond back that I got. Um, you can see we got a solar panel for our charging thing. And this is the thing that Siri sits in. And then, yeah. So, okay. Okay, well, thanks a lot for stopping by, Will, and we'll show you more stuff as we go. Bye-bye. one time came across a guy named Darren Alf. He's a bicycle touring pro. That's what his website is. He does all kinds of crazy bike bike rides all over the friggin' world. Well, this is the craziest we can do, and it's pretty crazy, I think. You know, it's pretty neat. Um, and I want to show you this, these big windmills they got here. They're cool. This is kind of a, is an old prairie, prairie land. some hills you know but we're kicking their ass but look behind us you see that see it doesn't look like much right now but it was it's bigger when when you're riding you know <laughs> yeah <coughs> and yeah so there you, there you go <laughs> excuse me you know Trev the next vacation we take I really want to choose a, a vacation I choose it not you Cause my, not something on the bicycle, like something beach related, you know? Aren't you having fun? Yeah, but you know, it's just, <sighs> something fun related. Thank you. 
right here. Lime Lake, I believe. We're camping over that way. It goes out this way. Gosh, I got really sun stuff today. I don't know if it's burned, but it's put stuff on it. It was just so strong and burnt right through the stuff. Nice little bridge. I'll show you the bridge. Sweet. This rock right there says 1965. Five years before I was born. Let's walk across this bridge. Right here, right there, it might be nice to find if you're looking for a spot to ski again. Maybe right here. Let's see. Walk right out. Don't go too far. There you go. Now it's recording. Okay, gang. Um, Trevor is going to make supper tonight. And he's adding some water to the pot, as you see. His name is Chef Marty tonight. Uh, so we're having these lentils. I'm not promoting anything by it on the brand name there. And then we're going to have some vegetables. Once again, I am not sponsored by Trader Joe's or I am not sponsoring Trader Joe's. But if they could, if they but wanted to. But if they could, to if they wanted money. to, they can. Yeah. But anyway, we're going to have some vegetables. And then we're going to make ourselves a little chicken sandwich with some shells. I am not promoting and I am not promoted by Sunkist. Same with Mission Tortilla Shells. I am not promoted by them, and I am not promoting them. I'm just showing you what we're going to be eating for supper tonight. Now, this little guy... There is a wind coming from that way. Yeah. This little guy, you guys, is so cool. It's called um, a rocket pocket. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> In the thing, I think it's pocket rocket or something. Oh. It's not like it's not. Let's he see, got the rocket in his pocket. Well, yeah, that's. <laughs> but anyway, so what we're gonna do, gang, is that we're gonna take these two packets that I showed you. Wait for it to kind of slightly come to a boil. We'll stick those packets in there, and you just boil it, and it only takes what five minutes. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So we will have dinner tonight. Um, <laughs> finally, uh, we got here at this campground. We are at Lime Lake Campground, I believe. Lime. Lime Lake Campground, uh, which is in what town, Trev? I'm sorry. Avoca. Avoca. So today we bicycled 37 miles. Well, 36.6, so rounding up to 37. Um, there was endless hills um it was to me it felt endless for a girl that's never done something like this before trevor hasn't either but um i just feel like he's more experienced than i am but um you love my sun tanning line folks i mean that's for my sunglasses um we got quite a bit of sun today and believe it or not um we did apply sunscreen i didn't apply sunscreen on my face um, I should, and tomorrow I'm going to, because tomorrow our destination is Mountain Lake, which is 41 miles from here, I believe. So that will be day two. Um, it is a, it's kind of overcast right now, which is really nice because our tent is kind of hot in there. Um, so we opened it up and hopefully it would vent out. I'm going to show you around here. There's not really much to see. Um, I think this is more of like a hangout place for like teenagers and 
and stuff on Friday and Saturday nights because the town of Aboga is like only 147, I believe. So I'm gonna turn the camera around so you can see. See how pretty it is? Lots of mature trees. Um, the lake is right on the other side of those trees. It's really pretty. Um, if I do look over there, if you see some water, that's the lake. Trevor was down there earlier. He was trying to find a skidding, like a skinny dipping spot for us because we're kind of hot and we're sweaty. Oops! Some birds attacking other birds. Very territorial. Some, someone must have babies. Um, but yeah, it's like I said, there's some really nice mature trees here. Um, that building that you see, you guys, is the restroom. It's kind of creepy. I went in there and all it is, you guys, all it is, is a toilet and a sink. But it, it kind of reminds me of like a like a horror movie that you would find out like in the middle of like nowhere and the door slams and it slams really heavy. Oh my god. But anyway, it was clean. It was a place to squat. So uh, I hope you guys have a great night and uh, don't forget to su um, subscribe to our channel, make a comment, hit a like button, you know, do whatever man, it's great. Anything to help us out would be greatly appreciated. Peace, love, and gravitude. Bye.